Great to be here. Uh, again, my name is Christian Johansson, CEO of TGS. Uh, thanks to Kimberly for giving a great introduction to TGS and what we do together with, with Hub Ocean. Anyway, uh, TGS uh, acquired a company called PGS quite recently. Uh, that was after acquiring a company called Spectrum in 2019. We acquired Ion Geophysical in 2021, which was a public uh, G and G company uh, noted on or um, uh, listed on the New York Stock Exchange, and then Mag Size in 2022, and then finally PGS, which means that we can truly call ourselves a company that energy starts with us. And energy starts with TGS is, rather, is a rather bold statement, as the uh, slide says here. But for more than 43 years, TGS has provided exploration data to the energy industry, enabling new discoveries and continued growth in energy supply to serve the needs of the growing population and help people out of poverty. Our market capitalization, as you see on the slide, is about $2 billion, and we're currently about 2,000 employees. And that's about a million dollars per employee, which is a great complement to our highly educated workforce operating out of more than 10 offices around the world. Of all the exploration data acquired since 2018, TGS is behind or is in charge of about 62%. So think about that enormous amount of data. That's about 3.1 million square kilometers of 3D data acquired by the vessel that you see behind me and seven other vessels. 6.3 million line kilometers of 2D data and more than 10 million digitized well logs around the world. That's an enormous amount of data to be processed, and it's processed by a combination of on-prem and uh, cloud compute. In 2023, this company consumed about 1 billion petaflops of data, which ranks TGS among one of the biggest data users in the world, and clearly one of Google Cloud's biggest clients, both in Europe and the US. Last but not least, sustainability is a core focus for TGS. We currently have an A rating with Morgan Stanley, and we consistently rank among the top tier within our industry. At TGS, we believe in partnerships, and we define our strengths to be the acquisition and processing of data using state-of-the-art technologies. Our GeoStreamer acquisition technologies, our ocean bottom node technologies, low frequency source, and SWI imaging technologies are all great examples of where TGS have developed leading edge technologies close to our core competen competencies. However, when we move away from our core, which is mainly in acquisition and processing, as I said, we believe partnerships can drive innovation and successful technology development. The collaboration of TGS and Cognite was created to combine TGS strengths in data collection and management and the ability of Cognite's data fusion platform to bring different types of data together. Cognite's expertise allowed TGS to streamline data flow and gain value from new insight into offshore performance. So one example of that would be related to vessel speed. Optimizing vessel speed offers great value in seismic serving. It's influenced by many factors, and it's historically been really hard to determine how do you optimize that. But in conjunction with Cognite, we now have the ability to automate speed control of our entire seismic fleet. That's just one example. Another example of a su successful collaboration between those two companies is a strategic partnership we, had, we both have with RKBP contributing to digitalize the operations of the Yggdrasil oil and gas area. Combining TGS and Predictor's data gateway with Cognite's data and AI software solutions to manage and optimize operations will be key to help RKBP setting in new standards in the way to operate the field with remotely controlled operations, unmanned production platforms, new technology and data-driven decisions and work processes. This is something TGS could never be able to do by ourselves, and neither could Cognite do it by themselves. So another great example of how the two companies can work together. But as I told John Marcus quite recently, I think we're just scratching the surface in terms of what we can do together. 
these are two great examples of scratching the surface, but I think the real value is to look into this enormous database of TGS that not even we understand what we can do about, and even our clients don't really, really appreciate what we can do in the future. We have about 60% of all the data acquired since 2018, and we're extremely well positioned to work with partners who can develop the next AI-based technologies to extract more value from this data. We may never get to the point where you can use machines to tell you exactly where to drill, but we can definitely get much closer than where we are today. Our customers are constantly talking about faster, better, and cheaper. And if there's one thing AI can do, it's delivering on that promise. We may need multiple partners to reach our goal of becoming the world's leading energy data company with the best assets and technologies to help customers grow their energy supply. And Cognite will be a key partner and contributor to make this happen. So in summary, I'm increasingly excited that we can grow our co collaboration help each other increase efficiency and both become very successful together. So I want to thank you all for inviting me to come here today and I'm looking forward to a great collaboration going forward. Thank you very much for your attention. Thank you, Christian.